Howdy! Carrie here from White, with Wyoming Sisters and I have a quick haul for you. Um, yesterday hubby and I um, were out of town and I got to go shopping and he kind of spoiled me. He got me some things for my birthday. Um, we got these at Target. They are a um, crazy loom and it's like a little kit that has like the little dividers and the different colors and it comes with 1800 of them and the 50 of the S clips and it even comes with an alpha sheet. I think these will be really fun for my nephews. They were originally 10 bucks and they were marked down to five so um, Shane was really funny. He's like get all of them! So I did. I got four of them but that'll be perfect for my four younger nephews. Um, so that was really fun and then we also went to a thrift shop and um, it was the Salvation Army and I got this it is like a little stand and I thought it would be perfect to display jewelry especially since I'm thinking about doing a craft fair and I can hang jewelry off of all of these hooks one buck and the markers which I have been using a lot um, to get different techniques these were a buck this is 50 cents I'm working on some uh, file folder journals and these are the little dividers and I thought for 50 cents those will be kind of fun to mix in there on um, some of these mixed media journals I'm working on. And then a set of playing cards for 50 cents. I already have like a dozen decks of playing cards, but they just always seem like such a fun element to add to things. And then I got this um, mold. I like to do um, candy making um, and this will be perfect to make some chocolate truffles and it was 50 cents. So for $4.50 I, I got all of those things. So, yeah, that was exciting. And then, um, we also went to Michael's, and they had Christmas things on sale. Um, I got this. It's embarrassing. My, um, desk is a mess. I have been crafting away, and so there's a mess. And these were, um, a wrapping paper kit. They're each 14 pieces. They come with a roll of, um, the brown craft paper and some tags, a white ink pad, and a sheet of stickers and an acrylic block and some ribbons. And these were originally, like, $15. I paid, like, $3 for them because all their Christmas stuff at Michael's was 80% off. Um, it was a little bit picked over. And I was excited, too, because I found these. And I'm... My nephews love those gingerbread houses from Oriental Trading, um, but the price on those keeps going up, and I know it has to, but I've picked these up. I picked up four of them for my four youngest nephews. My nephew that's 17 <laughs> won't be into this, but the others will enjoy these, and they're like the little foam pieces, and then they build like a little house, and so um, thankfully I haven't got, I, I got all my Christmas stuff packed up, but I didn't get um, the tubs put away yet. And so I'll get those tucked away. And those were like $1.79 a piece, which isn't bad for all the stuff that comes in there. There are like over 40 pieces. And at Michael's, they also had this. Um, this I got for half price. It was a Heidi Swap scrapbook kit. And it comes with um, some canvas pieces, some clear pieces, chipboard pieces, and cardstock. I've been making a lot of cards lately. And I am thinking about doing some journals and some scrapbook albums, some mini albums to get me excited again. So I picked up that. We found this for $14 um, when it's normally $30. It's a, a color print cartridge for the Cricut Imagine. A few years ago, um, Shane got me a Cricut Imagine for Christmas. This um, was $3, and I think it's and I paid full price for it, but I think it'll be worth it. It has little, like, journal prompts in it, and each one has two pages of journal prompts, and there are 30 sheets, so you get 60 of those, and it's by Recollections. That one was, like, $3. This was on clearance. It was $1.99. It's normally $4, and it's four sheets, and they're, like, rub-ons, and then you can use, it says you can use glitter, embossing powder, and much more. So I'm thinking, like, flocking. I'm having a hard time getting flocking to stay on things when I want to play with that. So I was thinking, you know, I tried out. They had some cute washi tape on sale. These were on sale for $1.49. Um, it's wider washi tape. This one has butterflies and this one has like little um, tags and journal things. 
and I and the butterflies were just beautiful and I love butterflies so I know I'll actually use this washi tape um, and then they had this one on sale too it's um, several different colors I think this one was like I want to say two dollars and it comes with five different colors it has the thinner tape and then um, the regular size tape I got this brush um, it was marked down to two dollars oh <laughs> Shane saw me looking at those and stuck those in my thing. Um, um, and these are like little stickers. They were on sale for 79 cents. I also got these two stamps for 30 cents a piece. They were with the Christmas clearance at Michael's. And um, yeah, I have a big pile of Christmas stamps. I'm actually looking over at them all <laughs> across the room. And it's pretty pathetic, but... I didn't have these two stamps, so of course I had to get them, right? 30 cents, can't turn that down. So that's um, what I got at Michael's. Um, the other place I got to go was Hobby Lobby, which is fun, but also overwhelming. They have like everything. All right, so I got a big variety of things. I um, got some glossy accents. I got another brayer. Um, I got some flavorings when my nephews were over a few weeks ago and they stayed the night. We made um, gumdrops, but the only flavor I had was cream to meth. And so um, the kids liked them, but I thought they were pretty disgusting. So I thought I would get some yummy flavors. Um, I got watermelon and strawberry and bubblegum. Ooh, I think they'll like those. So I'm going to put that with um, all my candy making stuff in the kitchen. Um, I got some ink pads um, so that they won't smear and I can use my La Plume markers with them. I got some E6000 because I want to do some jewelry making. These I picked up totally on a whim. Um, but they looked really like fun little elements um, and you get uh, 60 pieces. So. You know, you're getting a, a fairly good amount. I was just tape um, some more of those labels. Um, this stencil was um, $2.99, but I really loved the rose. I loved the look of it, so I got that. Um, I bought some acrylic paint. I got big bottles in black and white because those are two basics. This is fabric paint that was on sale for $1.44. Um, I, I, these bottles were $3 a piece and I just got primary colors. Um, this glitter was on sale for $2.50 and it is that real fine micro glitter. Oh, that was too pretty to pass up, right? And then they had some jewelry making supplies that were on sale. Um, these are little hair clips that have a flat piece, so I'll be able to embellish those. I'm thinking of making flowers. A gal at work is like, you should start making those fascinators. And I guess they're a, um, they're like little clips. Um, so these were 90 cents, but you get two of them, so they were 45 cents a piece. I figure it would be real simple to make, um, to make, to accessorize those and to add something to those. So I picked up all of those that they had and I cleaned them out. Um, I, I think they had like seven of them. And then they also had these. These are were 15 cents and they're pens. They're a flat front and then they're a pin on the back. Um, a real little one. Um, I really liked how they're, they're colored blue. I think that's kind of fun. So I got all of those and then they had this pendant where you can make your own pendant and that one was 64 cents that was a little bit more but I thought that would be really fun I could put um, a really pretty little picture or graphic in there and make a fun necklace these are fun too they're rings and they're obviously for a juvenile they're really tiny they were 15 cents a piece and they have the flat front so you can um, add something to them so um, I'm gonna figure out how to make a charm or a flower and just make like a fun piece of costume jewelry. Um, when the um, findings, the jewelry findings are less expensive, that'll um, help reduce costs. So that was my ginormous haul um, from yesterday. I had a lot of fun um, and I appreciate my hubby buying me stuff for my birthday. I don't normally just go out and 
get hog wild like this, but I, um, was really excited because he said, go to the store, um, and get whatever you want and I'll buy it for you for your birthday. And I thought that was just so sweet. He knows me so well. And it's getting at a point where I need to just start using stuff and clear out the craft room. But you know, you always want more to inspire you. So that's what I got. Thanks for watching and I hope you have a great day. Signing off from the Wild West. Bye!